Et bien salut tout le monde, c'est XVSK, aujourd'hui on se retrouve pour l'épisode 4 de la saison 2 de The Walking Dead Parmi les décombres, et on peut voir que l'image annonce bien la couleur je pense D'ailleurs c'est marrant de voir que qu'en fonction du chapitre en fait la couleur de du background change Là c'est plus vers le jaune, ici c'est plus vers le rouge alors que quand on regarde sur l'épisode 4, ben c'est plus porté vers le violet. D'ailleurs, si on tombe dans le menu, on peut voir que c'est pas cette vache est passé. Violet mauve. Donc voilà, on va arrêter de parler. On va se lancer. Let's go. Each 
Arthur's back. Oh. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it. Okay. We need a clear path to the trees. Maybe they're thinning out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? There. Oh. Damn it! Go back! Go back! Jane! Jane! Thank God. Stop. Relax. You need to walk slowly. You'll be fine. I can't do this. We can't clump together like this. It's better if we spread out. You two will be fine. No, you don't understand. Just help us. We should all stay together. Isn't that safer? Exactly the opposite. Push through that cluster of walkers. There's too many. We'll make a cow catcher. Just what we need. Okay, just tell me what to do. There. That one looks light enough to carry. I'm gonna get on the far side of her. I need you to get her attention. You're not gonna bite anybody now, are you? Follow me. Stay close. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. No, I'm not all right. J'ai pas compris le coup du épisode 3, c'est épisode 4 normalement. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. I'm sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? We'll watch out for each other. So long as we keep up a good pace. I know, I know. Just, I'm going as fast as I can. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. Jane saved us. I don't know how we would have gotten out without you. You don't give yourself enough credit. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. 
Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. <laughs> Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Rebecca, are you going to be okay? What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. We'll look after it together. Even if that's the case, you can't always protect everyone. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit, I didn't mean it. Shit. I'm sorry about your sister. Oh, damn it. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides... How's Kenny? I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. He started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. But it was scary. I've been nervous to even go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? The way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. He's not acting rationally. I should go talk to him. This is my fault. Hey, you did what you thought was right. That's all anyone can do in that situation. Sarita, God, wherever you are, please forgive me. I can't be alone again. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? What's wrong with Kenny? Why is Kenny acting that way? Do you think Kenny's okay? It's all I hear from anyone anymore. I'm just worried, worried about you. Worried, huh? Well, that's nice of you, seeing as this was your fault in the first place. Help anything. No, because it's sure as hell helping me. I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works! For the last time, just get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back that man's going through. At least you try. Still, doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water. It's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. We thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, Bonnie. 
Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands, too. What? Suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? Seeing you people floundering the minute things don't go according to plan has just got me on edge, all right? We should go find Luke, Sarah, and Nick. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine's right. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know, but you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. Look, I'm gonna level with you. You should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still, I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. And, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other. These are good people. We help each other. I can't leave that. You'd be surprised. How much help is Kenny going to be? What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken decisions. How can you get along without trusting anyone? That's exactly how I get along. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew. But groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You couldn't. What... what happened to your sister? <laughs> Seems we always want to talk about the end, don't we? You know, being a big sister is, well, it's funny. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut on purpose. I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. I don't even know why. Is that really what it's like having a sister? No, no. It's not all bad, but... What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't go unpunished. <laughs> Every summer we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there. And I'd... I'd pretend we weren't sisters. Just friends. <clears throat> All right, jackpot. Bet these walkers got some good stuff. That one's not coming back. See what else he's got. Yeah, we should check him out. But you know why, right? Only because they're fresh. Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted old pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. See what else he's got. I'll check this one.
Hold on to him. Emma's getting hard to come by, and things aren't going to get better. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. Smart haircut. Thanks. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? You fit in there, but you weren't like them. I've actually only been with them a little while. I don't know what it was like before I got there. But Kenny was different. I know that. That's it. A nail file. These things are great. Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Jamie always had one in her purse. It jabbed my hand when I went reaching in. <sighs> Can never be too sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. They're Sarah's. Looks like your friend didn't make it. Sorry. I don't know what to tell you. All we know is that she was here. It could be a good sign. Don't go getting your hopes up. Look, Clem, I know what you want me to say, but... Get off! Sarah! Goddamn! Shit! Okay, come on. We gotta find a way in. Looks like there's an opening over there. Look, he's your friend. You should do this. I'm sorry, Nick. Luke or Sarah or anybody needs to be put down. You gotta be ready for it. No hesitation. You know that, right? I know. I've done this before. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. Very effective. We can do this. Don't sound too good. Clock is ticking. I'm ready. I know you are. We need to get a better look. Just listen to me. How about you get the close one and I'll hop the fence to get the other? Go for it. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Nice work. No! You know what you're doing. Now watch this. Got a nice little addition to your arsenal. Yeah, <laughs> Take out the knees first. Then, what did you put a knife in the back do? of its head when it's down. Alright, let's get a look at what we've got on deck. 
It's gonna take some work to get over there. Glad you're paying attention. There's too many. We're not getting in while they're still hanging out over there. Maybe we can get them to move. Just get it together. Wait, we don't want to make any noise until we've dealt with those guys. Get away! You did the knee thing. Nice trick, huh? We are gonna die in here! a lot of walkers. They look worked up about something. And what gets the interest of the dead? Come on. People. How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure Sarah, those walkers over here. Then we might just be able to go through that other trailer and get to your friends. What do you think of that? If you think that's best, I'm with you. Good. Ow, what the fuck? What's going to grab their attention? I got you covered. We're gonna get up and go. Damn it, don't do this. That's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. Do, Sarah. Shut up. No, no. Come on. Damn it. What are you thinking? Fuck. If we lean him on the horn, it'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Sarah, what the Give hell? me a hand. We can't stay here. You don't. Uh, Crap. We gotta move it. It's locked. Then try something else. You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just get us in there. Hurry! Block this! Hurry! Sarah, please. Who's out there? Luke! Clem? Oh, thank God. Did Nick find you? He, he made a run for it. Looking for help. I... I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know. Fuck. 
fuck. When I heard y'all banging through the door. Luke, are you all right? Nah, no, I'm walking. I can't do much else though. But Sarah, she's another story. I, I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? You gotta help. Sarah, look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you. That they're okay. Sarah, come on. We, we have to go now. What's she doing? Can you get up? I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I, I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know. It was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then, while well, she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We're not out of the woods yet. What are we gonna do about her? We gotta do something. Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I, uh... They're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay. So, we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta... I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I could barely get her to look at me. Clem? Sarah, it's me. Hi. No! <laughs> Shit. Maybe it seems like you're all alone right now, but you're not. Yes, I am. But what about Luke and Jane and me? We came here because of you. All of us in the group. We're your family now. <laughs> Crap, we're surrounded. What? What about the skylight? Oh, we got. Clem! There's no time! Clem. Listen, Jane might be right. When everything started, I met my friend Lee. He tried to help me find my parents. He protected me more than anyone else in my whole life. He died to keep me safe. I was so scared. But you're still here. Because he taught me to be strong, even when I'm scared. Because he wanted me to live. And your dad protected you because he wanted you to live. He would still want that. Get to the skylight! Now! Come on, I'll boost you! My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. Clem, see what you can find. Can we use this? It's not big enough. The fridge. Forget it. That thing ain't budging. Find something else. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What? Oh, shit. Okay, ready? On three. One, two, three! Clem! Clem, help her! Help Jane! Okay, go, go! You first. We need you up top. Uh, 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 okay, come on. Clem! Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? I can't 
do it. Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. I can't! I can't! I can't! Daddy! Snap out of it, Sarah! Please! You can't save her, Clem. We have to go. Believe me, I know about this. Hurry up! Clementine! Grab her! We gotta go. Sarah. Come on! Look, I hate to ask this, but are we there yet? <laughs> We're not far. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. It's okay, I get it. Things aren't always simple. And just because you got her out of there today, doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the room. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her, or push her, or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us, forced us up to the roof... And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell, when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. I hope I did the right thing. I think you did. Come on, let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. But wait. Wait, where's Nick? I'm Rebecca. 
How about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He went in there after he left. Said he needed a minute by himself. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I've seen him like this before. That's why I was thinking you could talk to him. I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. Eh ben non, on n'ira pas dedans. <rire> Je suis un salaud. <rire> Je suis un salaud. Ce sera pour le prochain épisode, le bébé. <rire> eh ben dis donc, il y en a des morts dans cet épisode, j'ai l'impression. Hein <rire> eh ben putain. Vous imaginez, on pouvait abandonner, on pouvait abandonner Sarah quand même. Hein on avait l'occasion de l'abandonner. Ce boulet de bas étage. Non, j'ai conne. Euh, mais bon... Avec ce qu'elle a traversé, c'est vrai que je pense pas que beaucoup d'entre nous s'en remettraient, honnêtement. Bon, de toute façon, on va s'arrêter ici pour ce premier épisode sur euh, l'épisode 4. Donc, euh, en ce qui concerne euh, l'épisode 3 qui est affiché, à mon avis, ça doit être un bug. Ils ont pas dû vérifier. Euh... Parce que je suis sûr et certain. D'ailleurs, on va aller même vérifier maintenant que ceci est une erreur. Et on va aller le vérifier. Vous avez vu, j'ai pas fait quitter le jeu. J'ai juste fait. Euh... Regardez, voilà, épisode 4 parmi les décombres. Donc, à mon avis, ils ont bugué quelque part. À mon avis, ils n'ont pas, véri pas vérifié. On en est où Chapitre 3, chapitre 4, chapitre 5. Ah, vivement qu'on arrive au dernier quand même. Hein. Enfin, voilà, donc voilà, c'est moi qui c'est pas, pas, pas moi qui ai bugué, c'est la TTG Trap Team. <rire> Ou alors, c'est moi qui sais plus lire, mais bon, bref. À mon avis, de peut-être faire des vérifs. Hein. Allez Enfin, c'est moi qui dis ça en plus que. <rire> bref, je vais pas, je vais pas m'attarder là-dessus. Sur ce, loulou Prends soin de vous, prends soin de Kenrod, n'oubliez pas d'avoir la... Oui Attitude, comme nature, je serai pas au cul. Ok, c'est la chance, ça va, ça est, ce dicton. Je vous laisse, je vous fais plein de partout et je vous dis à la prochaine pour une nouvelle vidéo. Ciao, bye, et bouti bouti